Hello you, welcome back to Geekism. It's been a little bit of a while since I actually sat down at the computer to record something. Uh, we've had a video go every day, but uh, most of that was pre-recorded before Christmas. This is uh, now being recorded after Christmas, so it's been a little while since I've actually uh, sat down and done any, a bit of gaming, to be honest. So I was looking, trying to catch up where I was. Uh, Rarity fruit we need, because... Okay, he's getting a, a little bit peckish. There we go, so a little chomp on that. Uh, so in the last episode, we got our uh, sort of textile set up uh, up and running so we've got I'm not hungry anymore that's good uh, so over here we've got some um, spinning wheel that's got a yarn going on there we've got a weaving loom where we can make some cloth but we need more yarn we've got we've got cotton uh, and there's some cotton planted that's currently sort of you know working its way um, into becoming uh, cotton plants uh, somebody very uh, helpfully pointed out in the uh, in the comments that there is a plant later on that you can harvest um, uh, not necessarily cotton, but what you need to make uh, cloth with. Um, so in much the same way that at the moment I can randomly pick up uh, some fruits and vegetables, there are some, uh, like for instance, corn here. When that's fully grown, you can pick the corn from it and it will stay there and, and regrow. So there's a, there's a plant much like that one um that will keep giving you a plant that you can turn into cotton so that's uh, that's going to be useful so we'll come back to that uh, but this episode i want to really get this anvil uh, and for and forge in that set up so uh and try and start working towards some uh, some uh, saw and therefore wooden planks and all things like that so we need lots of clay which we have probably somewhere in a, in a tub somewhere we need a bellows and an anvil somebody also pointed out we now have a search feature which is very useful i say now we have one we've always had one um, so we can make it with leather or cloth we'll make it with cloth because we have cloth so that's great and we'll make it with anvil as well uh, iron ingots I've got loads of those did those off camera so now we should um, oh look at all this stuff that we've got that we just didn't know southern uniform hat it's awesome uh, somebody also pointed out that these cogs here that means that it gets placed in the world which is um, or at least gets placed in the world to work I guess uh, no actually it seems like see steel platform that should be placed in the world I would have thought. Anyway, hmm, maybe not. Uh, anyway, that's what we need. So clay. Let's go and find some clay. We've definitely got clay. One of these. We've got absolutely no sorting system at all at the moment with these things. They're all just chucked in to wherever they can be. Uh, yes, there's some clay. There we go. So let's take you out. Can we not? Are we full up of stuff? Oh, yeah. No, that went in. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Cool. So now we can craft a uh, forge, I think. Let's have a look. Crafting. Let's try that again. Forge. Okay. Construct. And there it is. Okay, so let's rotate it a little. Oh, rotates on a weird angle there. And we'll bring it here. And I think that will probably do quite nicely. Okay, so interact with, oh my words, there's loads of stuff we can make, including iron tools, which is like the next sort of step up. The main one we really need is this saw. Uh, sticks, I know we've got sticks. I think I've pretty much just put them in here, actually. Oh no, if I just picked up my pet rock, I didn't want to do that. Um, where did my pet rock just go? Yeah, we were, we were quite happy with the way you were, buddy. Um, v? Yeah, let's put you... Somewhere where we won't pick you up by accident. Let's put you up onto here for now. Uh, uh, let's paint, finish you the right way. The right way. Like there's a right way. And there we go. Pet Rock can sit out there for a bit. Uh, okay, let's try that again. In here, Clay Urn, I think we have sticks. We do. Okay, cool. So with me sticks, we can... Oh, we can make all of these, which is great. So I think... Sticks, hammer, yeah, yeah, yeah. We've got everything we need. What are that? Iron needle, okay. Iron axe, iron bow, iron armor pants. Oh, they use quite a few iron ingots. Okay, we need to get, let's get some iron ingots on the go here. That's that one, I believe. Uh, oh, I've got some more going here. Now they'll, they won't really do anything because. It's, oh, it's full of wood. It just needs lighting. Bit of a funky system, that, to be honest. There we go. We get some more, because those those are going to be very useful. I don't believe the ore does anything on its own. So, uh, bear trap, blank keys, casting mold, engineer's helmet. Oh, there's so much stuff. Iron helmet. Oh, that looks awesome. I think we're going to cut ourselves out in some iron garb. Um, 
but there are useful things as well. I know for a fact that this iron saw is super useful, so let's get you going. Um, are you not working? Do you need wood as well? You do. And you need to be lit as well. There we go. Wow. Okay. So that's blazing, so it's now making that up, which is great. Um, let's get a... Oh, a saber. Look at that. Or a machete. Or a sword. I, I can't imagine this, it's worth making more of those. Uh, one thing I do want to do then is let's break down all these uh, stone ones that we won't need anymore. Stone pick um, into gravel and wood pieces. Might as well break all these down and get what we can from them. Um, because they're not going to be useful. Now we... Oh no, shouldn't have done that hammer one. I think we need the hammer to make the other ones, actually. Let's have a look. Yeah, we can't make those now. Don't. That was me trying to be useful. Let's go back to the hammer. Uh, stone, then, is it? No? Oh, no. All we want. Hammer, there we go. Stone hammer. I need to make one of you. To make iron hammer. There we go. Okay, so we'll keep the we'll keep the stone hammer, but apart from that, I think we've kind of gotten rid of all the other stone tools, haven't we, for now at least. Uh, looks like it. What are you sewing kit? No, we'll keep you. Okay, cool. So let's get uh, let's get the saw out. Now I wonder if that's the thing we needed to get our wooden planks. Would ah oh, we did? Yes, awesome. So all of our wooden pieces now. Um, brick block log. Let's type in wood and see what we've got. Um, wooden beam. Oh, it still hasn't opened up the, the ones I was looking for, which was basically that brick block but made out of wood. Um, but we're definitely getting more options, aren't we? Okay, yep, yeah, definitely getting more options. Let's get over to here, cook up the rest of our... Uh, bits and bobs. So let's take an iron axe because that's quite useful. Um, we'll leave the glass blowing pipes and stuff until we've got a bit of a better idea of what they do. Craft that. Craft a knife. Um, or take a pick. Um, I kind of like the idea of the sword, to be honest. As cool as the war axe looks, we need a pole for that. But we'll get the regular axe going. Yeah, we need poles for all of those. Browsing weapons and tools. There we go. Let's have a look at stuff. I want to try and get some of this iron stuff going on. So, iron helmet, craft. Um, iron armor, craft. Iron armor boots, craft. I think those are the three pieces you need. Um keychain that's good so the, these are something else somebody pointed out these inventory holders so uh, these extra containers you can get like a herb bag you can get like a stone box things like that to, to sort of um, uh, you know truncate your your uh, uh, inventory a little bit which is uh, which is pretty neat okay so let's take all of this stuff that's working uh, we've now got the stone hammer I think so let's get uh, oh they've already gone down onto the bar which is good um, so which means we can now get, sorry we've got the iron hammer so we can now get rid of the stone hammer okay they're all still going take those we're gonna have a bit of an upgrade here folks oh yeah oops sorry didn't mean to do that uh, let's have a look four seconds five seconds we'll take the helmet we'll take the armor and uh, we'll take the Oh, not enough inventory space. Let's uh, see if we can fix that. Okay, so... Uh, where's our stuff? Helmet. Bang. Oh, wow. We're going to look good. Okay, so we'll break you down. We might as well break you down. I love the idea that you can break stuff down and make it useful. Um, let's see if we can get in there and get our boots. We can. Awesome. Okay, like that. Get them boots on. Oh, what are you? Grass skirt. Ah, so there must be iron leggings? Pants, there it is. Oh, we need a piece of cloth. I think we have a piece of cloth over here. Oh, we are looking the part without our pants. 
Uh, no, we need two more yarn before we can get cloth. Oh no, and none of our cotton is ready. So we're going to have to go and find some more cotton or um, or flax. Or what's the other one? There's th what are you? Withered, withered spinach. No, not withered spinach. The big one. Withered raspberry bush. No. There are three things we've got at the moment that can create yarn, which is uh, flax, cotton, and... Oh, that one there. Sisal agave, agave, I think it is. That was the one that somebody told me that that will, uh, that will keep producing cotton. So I don't believe we have that on this island but we definitely have flax it's like a blue plant so let's head out in our iron armor and underpants and see if we can find <laughs> some flax all right we went on a uh, on a flax outing whoops my head fell in there look um didn't really find anything of interest other than the flax that we wanted so i should now be able to do me iron pants there we go iron ingots cloth any hammer craft those up they're taking a minute. All right, so why they do that? Let's have a little look at some of this wood because this. Is, see here, we've got this brick, this brick piece. Uh, that's only four pieces down there, and that's the sort of stuff we're going to need to to get started on these larger structures, basically. So, uh, plank, plank. There we go. That I think that's what we. But that gives us five plank. Now we've got plank block and plank block. Okay, so now does that open more stuff up in wood? Small wooden sign, wooden raft. Um, what are that? A wooden bed. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? We need four poles. Do we have any poles? Let's see if we've got poles um, in one of our goodies. No, we've got sticks. We could probably make poles, but I'm just going to check we don't got any. Uh, we'll make, see if we can make some alchemist trousers now as well. I don't know if they do anything other than look good. Uh, okay, oh, we've got loads of flax there. Look, Ugh. <laughs> inventory management is not one of my strongest points, folks. I will warn you now. It's based, this game is basically inventory management 101. Uh, and it ain't, it ain't my uh, sauce. I was gonna say then <laughs> that's French for exit. It ain't my uh, forte. Let's have a look for pole then. How do we make poles? Is it made? Oh, it's made out of sticks. Okay, good. So let's craft. Um, let's craft a load of poles up because I've got a feeling they're more useful than sticks. Okay, so that uh, let's go back to our wooden bed. And we now have uh, the ability to create a wooden bed. Um, but I actually want to get rid of the old one first. So E is uh, pack it up. And now pick it up. There we go. And then not too sure why why the bed uh, why that pack has a different. I guess it says that it's it's more of a uh, exploring thing, isn't it, as opposed to a permanent one. Where's that funky bed we just made? Did it get dropped on the floor? No. Where? Oh, did we not make it in the end? Is it not getting made until it gets put until it gets put down? I guess yes. Two. We can still make two. Yeah, that'll be it then. So construct. Let's get yeah. There. Lie on. Oh, we've put it the wrong way around. Well, I mean, it doesn't really matter. What happened to it? Did it go back in our bag? Or did it get broken down into its original pieces again? It did, it got broken down into its original pieces. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, so now let's use H to... Where, 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 where? Absolutely no idea which is the front and which is the end back now. Uh, so let's try and put it somewhere. There we go. And now, no, we're still lying on the wrong way. Ugh, whatever. Okay, it's fine there. But now what we can do is once we're lying on it, we can uh, click. Nope, no, nope. We can click this button and it lets us sleep and we can sleep through the night. Because it was almost night time, but... Oh, why have we woken up? Are we hungry? I guess we're hungry. We have... Very little to eat. I mean, there's, we've got stuff. We've baked potatoes, that will do. Say so we've got some ro some plain vegetables, but I don't really uh, 
like eating those. I think you get better hunger stats. Cannot sleep outside in this. Oh, the weather's bad. Oh no, we're gonna have to start looking at putting a uh, a roof on this little old hut, isn't we? All right. Well, in that case, we best wait till morning. Right, that was one hell of a storm, but uh, while it took place, I've crafted up some uh, wood roofs, uh, or roofs, and, uh, and filled out some logs. I mean, this looks janky as hell, but it's a it's a place where we're not going to die, and we're going to be able to sleep through storms, alright? So we can get in there, there's roof pieces. I think the way it works is that you can use anything to do anything, but uh, if you use a roof piece specifically, then the game will acknowledge it's a roof, and uh, and therefore not wake you up when it's, uh, when it's raining and things like that. Um, can we pick potatoes? Yes, we can. Let's pick all of those then. Great stuff. And uh, we've got a few more potatoes. A few more uh, cotton over here as well. Oops, didn't mean to pick that one up. Don't. Probably should have left these all to, to do their own thing. Uh, but never mind. The last thing that I really want to do on uh, on this fine, uh, fine level here is craft up a few of these. We need a kiln near it. Uh, so let's do that uh, because somebody pointed out that there was something if you remember way back um, uh, There was something on a statue that I thought might have been quite interesting I, but I kind of gave up with it and uh, Somebody pointed out that actually Probably not giving up with it would have been a better idea So we're gonna light up some of these Get some of those uh, bricks because we can use those as platforms to jump up and see if we can grab hold of it and uh, if you remember what I'm talking about. Uh, good for you. Let's find out. Okay, heading over to where I was. I'm hoping that my... Oh, it does as well. I was going to say, my, I'm hoping my iron armour and iron uh, weapons make good use of, uh, you know, easy work of these things. Do you know what? I'm going to go for the other one then, because I could do with the hide, to be honest. I think we're taking these out pretty easily. Um, but, you know, we're taking a little bit of damage. I'm not 100% sure how to get health back, to be honest. It's probably... Um, probably bandages because it doesn't seem that food does it. I'm gonna eat all these raspberries that I've got to. Oh, there's another one. A pack, we basically took out a whole pack of wolves. That one's a bit bugged out, so we might as well make the most of it. Um, if I remember rightly, a crazy statue friend is just over the brow of this hill. Down here, Oop, over this little tree. I think it was in this clearing here. Aha! It isn't. Hoo hoo! Or is it? No. Hmm. Okay. I'll keep exploring. Okay. I found the guy. He was a little bit further out than I remember him being. Um. But this was definitely him. We've got uh, loads of logs here. Look that we tried to work our way up to but somebody said there was something in his hand that would come in useful so let's get up here bank i can't i think we took everything we wanted out of here there's some crazy ass stuff like toys and you know maybe not so useful stuff like that that one was locked um we've kind of figured more stuff out by now though haven't we so let's have a look uh do do have a little walk there uh yeah so we're gonna try and uh, get up here a little bit higher so let's get these on the go and if we can yeah there we go that's what I was trying to do and then I'm hoping we've got logs as well yes so we're gonna do a bit of a uh, bit of a Super Mario jobby here oh, that didn't really matter, does it? there we go that way yes there we go and then another one of you on top and I should be able to jump ah ha 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 we can and uh, let's do that again um, that way whoops there good and then one of you on top uh, should be able to jump up there we go and I'm pretty sure now from wherever we are we should be able to get to what it uh, what it on so we can have rotten seaweed we're not really interested in that what I want to try and do is get round to... Ah! I fell off. Uh, oh, my God. I thought, <laughs> thought it would throw me up. Uh, you notice my uh, health regenerated. I bought, um, I, I built some bandages uh, using some rags. So that was good. 
um, as that could have been a lot a lot worse. Am I gonna am I gonna have to add a bit of twig on here because this might be a bit too high to jump now? Eee, come on, come on, we can do this. We can do this. We were up there once. We can get there again. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I've got a feeling this might be too high. All right, well, let's uh, let's have a little think about this. We can put one here. Uh, I do f I do quite like the fact that you can't just float stuff though. You know, it's all got to be built within reason. That's not what I meant to do. Uh, okay, let's try this once more. Here we go. Whoops. Swing it around to there. Put these on top. Okay. Now we should be able to jump on from this one. This one to this one. To this one to this one. We could do this before. Why can't we do it now? To there, to there. To there. Why does that head disappear occasionally? Whoops, okay. Uh, okay, rotten seaweed. Let's try this again. Rotten seaweed I'm not interested in. Seaweed I'm not interested in. Map is what I want. Come on, buddy. Zoom in, see if that helps. Map, pick. Beautiful. Open map. And there we go. So now, we have a map. Okay. Um, is there any like, last minute things? Can we... Are you a bit harder than you look? What about pick? No. Uh, knife, hammer, maybe. Whoops, we're dropping down anyway. Okay. All right. Well, we'll leave that stuff. We may well be able to come back for that, and I feel like we should probably try and take our structure down as well. Um, we can at least do that with the brick blocks because they're new. Uh, whoops. No. Yeah. Come on. No, they just have been there too long, haven't they? Okay. See how many hits with this hammer it takes to take one of these out. As to whether or not it's worth doing it for all the rest of them. Uh, oh, there's a birdie up there, look. Uh, yeah, forget it. Okay. Let's run back with our map. And what happens now with a map? Do we have to open it? Or will it just find ourselves? Okay, so let's run a little way. With the map in our hand. We're doing some uh, on-the-fly troubleshooting here. We're doing some deep work. So that's the map in our hand. If we open it, it looks like it fills in. Okay. So let's try now without it in our hand and see if it continues to fill in. What are you? Oh, it's a goat. Okay, we'll leave goats to it right now. I'm not interested. It'd be nice if we could tame them and milk them. I don't believe that's an option just yet, but it's probably somewhere on the road map. Okay. Let's have a look at the map now. Open map. Yeah, okay. It looks like as long as we've got the map on us, it's uh, it's filling stuff in, okay, and it looks actually quite useful in uh, regarding information because I think these here are our, uh, are our metal deposits, so that's actually quite useful. It'd be quite nice if we could uh, mark on the map, I guess, which I don't believe we can, other than we can move around and we can zoom out a little bit as well. Um, but otherwise, that's actually quite a useful bit of kit. Let's um let's see if we can head back to base. I'll tell you what, last thing we'll do actually, let's chuck the map in uh regular inventory. Let's, I mean let's take it off the off the bar and see if that works. Because then as long as we've got it on us, just walking around is enough to uh open up some of the options, you know. Let's have a look. Uh 
Ah, is that a, is that bugged or? Yes, it is bugged. Yeah, okay, so it seems like we don't actually have to have it equipped. As long as we have a bag, a uh, map in our bag, it looks like it updates uh, wherever we walk, which is actually super useful, especially for um, having a rough idea of where we are on our island. Let's see if it um, actually sort of shows up man-made stuff that we've built. Something sleeping there, I don't know what it is. What sleeps? Oh, it's a sleeping crab. Oh, well, I'm going to leave you to it, buddy. I have no interest in uh, taking out crabs, <laughs> so to speak. Uh, come on, where's our base? It wasn't this far away, was it? Maybe it was. Okay, I can see smoke. That was actually much, much further out than I thought, to the point where I think probably it would have been quicker to go the other way around the, <laughs> around the island. But at least we're sort of mapping out the coast now. We've got a bit of an idea of how uh, how big the place is. Because, like I said, this is just one of many islands. You know, the clue is in the name of the game here, folks. Uh, we're hopefully going to be able to uh, explore a bit further afield. But here we are. We're back at base. So let's um, let's have a look at a look at this map and see if it shows us man-made uh, built things. It doesn't seem like it does, unfortunately. That's a shame. It'd be nice to be able to know where you are. So I suppose we just have to kind of remember we're at the top of this uh, sort of little outposty bit here. Um... Other than that, probably isn't really much we can do. So let's uh, let's quickly get this fire built back up for the night. And uh, we will interact with this and get our... Oh, we've got some veg. That's good. And we'll craft up some meat. I think that kind of fills you up longer than the roasted veg. Uh, which is still handy, though, because it's early days. And simple food for simple people is uh, is what we're all about. Okay, cool. So now let's see if our roof works. Uh, I've noticed that for some reason, <laughs> it doesn't seem like we can... Uh, we can... I think it was because of the stepping stone. It was, yeah. Okay. Unfortunately, it wouldn't let us fit through, but we can fit through that side. Okay. Um, which is kind of interesting. We have a door. Uh, we have door carpet and we have iron doors. We haven't figured out wooden doors yet. Okay, maybe that's next episode. Uh, any ideas on wooden doors, let me know. Let's press sleep and we'll have a little kip through the night. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, you can give us a like. It really does help out that channel. And if you aren't already, don't forget to subscribe. Any thoughts, or queries or suggestions, you can uh, pop it down in the comments. And if you fancy a chat, you can find me on Twitter. I'm at John T. Sparrow. Um, thanks very much for watching. Have a fantastic new year, and I'll see you in the next one.